Money problems at American Hebrew Academy in Greensboro has led to no job and no school for many families. The school closed permanently yesterday, and today some staff got their separation letters. WFMI News 2's Adoria Chumba is digging deeper into the numbers. The luxurious 100-acre campus has a total asset value of about $85 million. That includes $20 million in property value and an $11.6 million athletics and pool center. But American Hebrew Academy tax records show exactly what kind of financial trouble the prestigious Jewish boarding school was in. Despite tuition and boarding fees of $42,000 a year, the school was progressively losing money. In the 2016-2017 school year, it spent $18 million in overhead cost, but only made $5 million. The previous year, it lost $10 million, and donations dropped from $3 million to just $400,000 within, within an academic year. And in the letter sent to the school's body, Glenn Drew, the school CEO, and Lior Saber, the board chairwoman, wrote, that the academy simply lacks the financial resources to continue as a viable concern given rising schools costs and low enrollment growth. Now, community organizations are scrambling to help about 80 employees find new jobs and about 100 students a new school. We can help them with job networking, with housing, with uh, basic living needs um, to see what we can do to help, to provide counseling as needed for every individual affected. Now, Greensboro Day School says staff and parents can contact them to find out about opportunities for jobs and enrollment. A Hebrew charter school in Florida is also extending open spots to displaced students.